Mitsubishi Gallant 1976-80. The third generation of the car was introduced in 1976, and was known as Gallant, Sigma. In many export markets the car was simply known as the Gallant. At that time, the Dodge Colt in America was actually a Mitsubishi Lancer, not the Gallant anymore, but nonetheless the Gallant wagon variant was sold with the Dodge Colt label in the US and Canada. In Australia, where the car was made locally at Chrysler's Cloverley Park plant, it was marketed as the Chrysler Sigma and, after the 1980 buyout of Chrysler Australia by Mitsubishi, as the Mitsubishi Sigma. Australian content was quite high and included a locally made 2.6-litre restaurant 4, introduced 1980, which, in December 1985, replaced the 1.6, 1.85 and 2-litre engines used in other export markets. The wagon version was introduced in 1977, a little while after the sedans. A new two-door coupe was introduced in 1976 to replace the Gallant GTO. It was known in Japan as the Gallant, Lambda. The coupe was sold in the United States between 1978 and 1980 as the Dodge Challenger and Plymouth Sapporo. In Australia the Lambda was marketed initially as the Chrysler Sigma Scorpion and later as the Mitsubishi Scorpion. Mitsubishi introduced the MCA jet engine for Japan and other emissions controlled markets with its latest Gallant. This incorporated the jet valve a secondary intake valve which improved emissions without necessitating the need for a completely redesigned cylinder head. In 1978, Mitsubishi in Japan established a dedicated dealership sales channel called, Japanese, Gallant Restaurant, to sell the Gallant and other selected vehicles. After late 1977 the 1850 variant was discontinued, as Mitsubishi focused their efforts on making the 1,600 and the 2,000 engines pass the new, stricter emissions standards. In Japan, the Gallant range received a new variant in March 1978, known as Gallant Sigma Eterna. This model has single rectangular headlights and different taillights. This model also sold as facelift model for selected markets in Europe, New Zealand and South America. Seven months later the twin round headlights front design was replaced with one featuring twin square headlights and also new taillights. Models with engines which passed the new 1978 standards changed from the A120 to the A130 range. Mitsubishi had limited resources, and the large choice of engines for the Gallant lineup was reduced to one 1.6 and one 2.0, with 86 and 105 PS. 63 and 77 kilowatts, at the beginning of the 1979 model year. Todd Motors initially assembled 1.6 GL, 1.85 GLX and 2 liter GLS sedan models for New Zealand, with the GLS getting a 5-speed manual transmission as standard with 3-speed auto optional. These were the first NCO assembled Mitsubishi to have rear screen V-misters as standard. Early cars had conventional rod suspended headliners developed locally to meet local content rules but these were notorious for collapsing onto the passengers heads and were quickly replaced by newly developed, glued in molded foam liners. The range was later revised to add the wagon and drop the 1.85 liter engine. The third generation Gallant was the recipient of the Car of the Year award in South Africa in 1977. In South Africa, where it was built by the Sigma Motor Corporation, it was sold as the Colt Gallant. Originally sold with the 1.6 and the 2.0 liter engines, the automatic only 2.6 liter engine arrived in the middle of 1979 and was developed locally. The 2.6 arrived elsewhere only later. Mid-1979 was also when the face lifted, square headlights, model appeared in South Africa, with new low inertia engines power output for the 2.0 liter remained at 65.5 kilowatts, 89 PS, 88 horsepower, but period testers felt it more powerful than the previous version, 